So as the title suggests, we're going to show you the top 5 diagnostic tools for your car under £150. We'll also show you some multi-vehicle tools but these will generally come in over the £150 budget. We've personally tried and tested all of these tools, so we do believe we're in a good position to advise you of the best tools for your vehicle. Now in the description and in the pinned comment section, you'll find a link to where you can buy these tools online, and we recommend buying only through these links. This means you'll be buying from a trusted source where all tools are genuine products and you need to be aware of fake and clone units on the market, because they do exist. So let's take a look at the top 5 tools for your vehicle. So we're looking at handheld tools with integrated screens for your Honda vehicle, Honda or Acura really. Um, we have five tools on display here which all range uh, in different uh, coverage and system coverage and vehicle coverage as well. And I'll talk you through all of these kits. We're going to start at the cheapest tool and work our way along to the most expensive tool. Um, the cheapest tool on the market is the iCarsoft MHM version 1.0 kit. This tool will work on the Honda and Acura vehicles for the main systems. Uh, so the main systems being the engine, airbags, ABS, transmission, and it, it will also do oil service reset as well. Uh, in some cases it will work on other systems like air conditioning, power steering, convertible tops, central locking, but it all really depends on the vehicle that you're using it on. So if you're unsure about one of those additional systems, then please use the email address that I put in the description below this video, and they, those guys will get back to you as soon as possible. Um, the, the link for all of these kits is in the description below this video as well. So that's the version 1.0 kit. That is a perfectly suitable tool. You know, let's say for example in your Honda, if you only have like an airbag light that you need to reset, then this tool will be perfect for your needs. There's no need to go spending more money on a tool which has more functionality than you actually need. If all you're interested in is resetting an airbag light, then this tool is fine. But I will talk about the benefits of the other tools as well. So moving on from the MHM version 1.0, we then come to the uh, HNM tool, uh, HNM2 in fact it's called, and this tool will do everything that this tool will do, but it does have a few additional uh, functionalities and coverage as well. Uh, so you know this thing will do um, on selected vehicles DPF, it'll do electronic throttle control, oil service and brake service, steering angle, sensor calibration and electronic parking brake. So it gives you a few more systems to actually diagnose and reset over the version 1.0 kit. So that's a good option, <clears throat> that's been around for a few years now, that's generally seen as an older style generation tool, uh, but they still provide updates for it, they still uh, offer support for it, so there's no reason why you should be put off by a tool like this. Um, this is a newer generation tool, this is the iCarsoft JP version 2.0 kit. Now this kit will do everything that these two kits will do, but this does have a few more uh, vehicle coverages and system coverage or function coverages. So with regards to vehicles, um, this covers all Japanese vehicles. So yes, it covers Honda. It also does Mitsubishi, Mazda, Nissan, um, Subaru, Toyota, Lexus. I, mean, I think they're all Japanese. Um, I stand corrected if I'm wrong though, but it covers all of those vehicles. That, you know, as I say, click the link in the description and it'll show you all of the, the vehicle coverage for this tool but those are the vehicles it covers with regards to system and functionality it does everything that these two kits will do but it'll also allow you to do injector coding and abs brake bleeding so again that actually depends on the specific vehicle so use the email address and uh, those guys will tell you if those functions are suitable for your specific vehicle we then move on to the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. This is my recommended pick. This is the top uh, package that I would recommend to anybody who is looking for a multi-vehicle, multi-system package. Uh, simply because I, I feel it represents best value for money when it comes to system coverage, vehicle coverage, versus the price you pay for the tool. Um, there are tools out there with, where you'll pay a lot more money uh, to get a lot less functionality. Well, this tool, is a great compromise between the two um, and it, it offers more functionality 
than a lot of the expensive tools. So that's why I believe this tool is the best tool on the market right now for multi-vehicle and multi-system. Uh, but it covers everything that these vehicles will do. So let's say these are Japanese vehicles. Um, it covers all other Asian models as well. So you know, you've got the likes of Hyundai and Kia. Um, I'm sure there's other um, Asian manufacturers as well, but it does the European manufacturer, so it'll do all of the, the likes of Audi, BMW, Mercedes, Seat, Skoda, Vauxhall, Porsche. Um, there's so many to list, in fact, but it covers all of the Europeans. And it also does the Americans, so the likes of Chrysler, Chevrolet, Jeep, Dodge, GMC. It'll cover those as well. But again, it does all of the functions, it covers all vehicles. Um, all of the functions in which we've mentioned and I feel if you if you maybe you've got one eye on the future if you're looking at future vehicles to make sure your tool covers future vehicles or indeed you've got friends family with other manufacturers then this tool is uh, is definitely the one for you that's just my opinion in fact but that's just what I believe um, we would then move on to the Autel MD808 Pro kit. Uh, this kit, well, Autel are generally seen as the leader when it comes to diagnostic tools. They've been around the longest, so they do have a great extensive knowledge of diagnostic packages, and because of that, they're able to put together fantastic systems. Uh, as I say, it's the most expensive though, but it does cover a lot of vehicles. Um, additional functions like service reset, electronic park and brake, diesel particulate filter, steering angle sensor, throttle control. Um, interestingly though, this kit doesn't cover injector coding or ABS brake bleeding and that goes back to what I was saying earlier about this kit because this kit does cover those functions and it does come in at a lower price. So make your own mind up on that but there are a lot of tools out there and it's really quite confusing at times to, to know which tool is best for your needs, uh, which tool is best for your vehicle or vehicles uh, and that's really why we put together videos like this uh, to sort of hopefully give you a little bit of a knowledge and a little bit of information about what tool is best for yourself but if you are still a little bit unsure then please use that email address in the description below this video and um, those guys will get back to you and give you an answer as to what tool is best for your specific needs and your specific vehicles so i hope you've learned something thanks for watching and i hope it helps